Today we're looking at the iRig mic. We're going to compare it with the internal mic systems of a few different mobile devices. I think you're going to like what you hear. I'm using the iRig mic with the Samsung Galaxy S3. The iRig mic has three separate gain controls. You can use it for any of your audio needs, um, whether you're recording a demo, originals, doing an interview, voiceover, whatever you need it for. Now I'm going to remove the iRig mic. And now you're hearing the internal mic on the Samsung Galaxy S3. And you'll probably notice a lot more ambient noise, probably just, just doesn't have the quality as when I had the iRig mic in. Okay, I'm going to put it back in. Okay, now we're going to go outside and listen to what it sounds like out there. Hey, I'm using the iRig mic with an iPhone. And we're outside. You can see it's a little windy, a little chilly. But I'm going to take it out of the phone now, and you can hear what it sounds like without it. Okay, so probably hearing a lot of noise. It doesn't sound very good, I'm suspecting. So I'll put it back in. Woo, that's a lot better. So we're going to head over to the marketplace and check out what it sounds like there. Hey, everybody, we're in the marketplace like I promised. And uh, we're using, or I'm using, an iRig mic with an iPad. But you can also use it with an iPod or an iPhone and some Android devices as well. So um, you can hear what it sounds like here, and I'm going to pull out the device. Now you can probably just hear lots of what's happening in the marketplace. Pretty noisy, I'm sure. Okay. Thanks for checking out the iRig mic. And for more information, you can go to ikmultimedia.com.